So we got a new rendition of the Luna 4 this time in Cuban fiber. Demonstrated by little Jakey. Hey Jakey. And so this one is uh, with the pole. It's uh, just uh, around one kilogram in weight or 2.2 pounds. Four man tent. Uh, basic model of the Luna 4 Wilderness Bear Paw designs. Uh, the only modification was that I had a, a snow skirt put in, which is basically just an extra uh, foot of material that hangs down on the bottom and it lets you just kind of fold that underneath the tent and act as a little bit of a wind guard when you're trying to lock it down. So this tent is locked right down right now and uh, that's going to that's gonna help uh, things a little bit. Uh, in the snow conditions, it would help keep uh, spin thrift out of the way. Uh, really interesting, I haven't really used Cuban fiber yet. Uh, it's lighter weight, this is 0.74 ounce per, per whatever it is. And uh, one thing that I'm noticing is it, uh, it packs a little bulkier than sil nylon does. Uh, but then again, uh, one of the advantages, it's lighter weight and it is uh, supposed to be very strong and it's completely waterproof. So, just a little walk around. So he has the vent this time uh, positioned in the back of the tent as opposed to the front. So a slight design modification. Uh, I imagine with the door slightly open, that's going to help uh, move ventilation a little bit better and uh, he's got extra tie outs uh, so he's got the standard uh, tie outs in the center but then there's these extra tabs on either side so you can really lock them down uh, if you're going to use all of those you're going to need uh, 16 pegs uh, and then the, the center tie outs just to uh, open it up if you want to string that to some trees So really, really interesting tent and we're going to use this in May, uh, May 15th in uh, Naganosh Lake Provincial Park.